Deadly mass shooting can have a deep impact on students' mental health and not just in the Barrow County community. Yeah, students across the nation could be impacted and parents may not understand how to approach the topic. Fox 5's Brittany Etney is at the live desk with advice from mental health professionals. Brittany, so many people don't know the words mm -hmm. to use to describe this to their young ones. Yeah, and it's a conversation that many parents don't expect to have with their children, but experts say school shootings can impact kids everywhere, even if they aren't showing obvious signs. The mass shooting at Appalachia High School exposed many of its students to graphic and violent acts, something that can put their mental health at risk. Psychotherapist Laura Moore says everyone reacts to trauma differently. In the initial phases, again, there's shock, and then following that might be a heightened sense of um, hyperarousal, some anxiety, trouble sleeping, maybe people having like unclear memories. And seeing violence at such a young age can develop in the weeks and months that follow. Once um, our psyches and our bodies understand that we're no longer in danger, then a lot of extra thoughts and experiences can arise um, either somatically with headaches, um, stomach aches, um, pain in a particular way, and then sometimes survivor's guilt of, you know, did I do enough or should I, you know, why my friend and not me, why this teacher and not me. And can stick with them for a lifetime. So let them know it's okay to express how they feel. So it's really important to, of course, know your child, know what your child might need, and then find things that are supportive for your children, even if they don't ask for help and be ready to bring in other resources if they exhibit more extreme signs. If you start to see acute symptoms where they don't seem to be functioning or they can't return to school without feeling incredibly panicked or their sleep is off or their appetite is off or they're extremely irritable, then you may need to find them professional help and support. The U.S. Surgeon General cites a recent study that found 51% of 14 to 17 year olds in the U.S. worry about school shootings. So even if your child wasn't directly impacted by the shooting in Barrow County, it can still prompt those concerns about if it'll happen to them. At the live desk, Brittany Edney, Fox 5 News. Yeah, so many people across the nation feeling this. Brittany, thanks so much.